Shape Machine is a new medium for visual calculations that process geometry. Word processing technologies are ubiquitous, allowing us to search for any character, word, or phrase we want to find in a text, and even to replace or change it. But what about in visual domains? How can we process geometry used for all sorts of visual descriptions in another way? Developed by the Shape Computation Lab at Georgia Institute of Technology, Shape Machine is a new way to search, process, and program with shapes. When you work with drawings in a PDF, DWG, or any vector-based file, there are often parts that you want to revise. Shape Machine can recognize these parts and any parts. The software is built on a new geometric representation that redescribes the line work entirely, making this a searchable, living drawing. Shape Machine allows scientists, engineers, designers, and students to experiment with shape computations in an intuitive visual way, to playfully generate designs like the Celtic knot, and also to precisely declare designs with shape rules, like for tilings, that can be generated all at once. Visual computations in Shape Machine are achieved by drawing rules to generate designs, like here in the Draw Script module of the software where four rules are composed and compiled to generate a mechanical gear. This makes coding as straightforward as a manual sketch. Here the visual code is revised by programming with shapes, meaning the shape rule is simply redrawn for a new specification. The entire code is then recompiled in DrawScript to produce a new iteration of the gear design. enabling a novel, visual approach to design automation. Here, John Portman's formal language is programmed in Shape Machine to generate the original design of Portman's 1964 house and variations based on the same architectural logic, like this automated 3x3 design, illustrating how programming with shapes opens up new possibilities for visual inquiry. Prompting us to ask, what else can this mean? If standard digital calculations can be achieved visually in the shape machine, can we implement a visual computer? And if so, what kind of world would that lead to?